Okay, this is Eric Windheim, building biologist and electromagnetic radiation specialist. Today we are uh, examining a solar edge string inverter. And we found out that the predominantly high frequency that is generated by the inverter is at 16 kilohertz. Actually, it's 16.2 kilohertz, as you can see right over here in the corner. So that's 16,200 times per second. And that's the distance between these two cycles. We also find that the amplitude between the bottom of the 16 kilohertz waveform and the top of the uh, waveform is 2.645 volts, or about 2.6 volts. That's a big transient when it's happening 16,000 times per second. By the way, this is the Stetzer meter and this is a 10x Stetzer meter, so this puts us at 3,480 GS units. 3,480 GS units. 25 or less is ideal. 25 to 50 is uh, potentially hazardous, and at over 50, it becomes a biological problem for all people, with some people becoming symptomatic right off the bat and others taking longer. What we're going to do right now is we're going to turn off the solar and I want you to watch what happens to the Stetzer meter when I turn off the solar inverter. Okay, so what we have now is that is 160. Now we have everything in the entire house off. So this is just the dirty electricity that's coming in on the utility feed lateral and it's caused by dirty electricity devices next door. So this is what we actually have as an ambient, but we are up there at 3,480. And that was uh, caused by the solar inverter. So this is not a clean solar inverter, and it's not one that would be good for anybody that is concerned about being exposed to dirty electricity. Thank you very much.